Hey folks, my name is Ben and today I'm going to walk us through building an online course in 10 minutes or less using the Podia online course builder. I did put a couple of things together so I wasn't doing this completely from scratch and I recommend you do the same. The things I have are a course outline so I've broken up my online course into different modules and lessons and then the course assets so I've got titles for each of the modules. I have titles and video files for each of the lessons, and I've also written out questions for the quizzes that I'm going to include in the course. This is going to be an online course about songwriting for a brand that I made up called Song Study, but it's going to have all the same components of a regular course. So I'm going to go ahead and start the clock and we're going to dive in and see if we can get this done in 10 minutes or less. All right, so I'm starting on the dashboard and I'm going to go ahead and click create select product and then I'm going to type the name of my online course and create product. All right, so first I wanna put in the details. I'm going to leave the name and pick my logo. And then I have a description already saved that I'm gonna copy and paste. I'm gonna edit that a little bit. There we go. And I think that's it for the details. Oh, there was one more, yeah, okay. Good, all right, so that's it for the details. I'm going to say done. And now I wanna go ahead and add my course content. So I'm gonna click on edit and I'm gonna create a new section. Now I've got my course broken up into three different modules. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy all of the content from the first module. I'm using a tool called Clipboard History that lets me keep multiple items in my clipboard. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and select and copy every single one of those. It's a little bit of a cheat, but it saves me some time. Okay, so now I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna add my module title and description. save that. All right, now I'm going to add the files and these are going to be the videos, uh, the video lessons for this section. So there are three separate ones and we'll just wait for those to upload for a moment. And uh, once they're done uploading, I'll be able to add the titles for each one. I just put those in the proper order. There we go. All right, we'll go through and just add these titles one by one. And last one. Okay, and then I also want to add a quiz, so I'll go ahead and add a quiz section, put in the title of the quiz, and then my first question, let's see if you can guess while I'm plugging these in here. It is all of the above. All right, create question and I'm gonna make that visible and click done. And that's it, my first module is done. So I'm gonna go ahead and move on to my next module and I'm gonna select all of those as well. That way I can just zoom through and paste them. That's going to be that, that quiz, which Disney song is the best Disney song is going to be a good one. All right. So I'll paste in the module title for that one and the description and click save. Now I'm going to scroll down and add my files. So we're going, there are four in this one, so I'm gonna select those four and upload those. Let those upload for a moment. All right, now I'm gonna put those in the correct order and go ahead and title each of those. Select that, lesson one. Let's scroll down. And Put in the title for lesson two. 
now the title for lesson three. And lesson four. All right, and then this module also has a quiz, so I'm gonna add a quiz. And it's module two. Oops, okay, there we go. There's the question I think I put in. There we go, selected the wrong thing. Which Disney song is the best? Let it go. Part of your world, the circle of life, or go the distance. Those are all really good ones, but I'm gonna have to say go the distance on that one. All right, create question. I'm gonna make that visible and click done. And now two modules are done. So now I've gotta make the last module. I'm gonna go through and select everything for that module real quick. Now I actually do have a background in music, so I'm not completely making some of this stuff up. Um, but if you tried to go and uh, take the online course, you would see that these videos are all just really short, like one or two second clips and don't actually have anything in them. So. So unfortunately it's not real, but maybe one of these days, maybe one of these days I'll make an online course about songwriting. We'll wait for these to upload. Okay. And then put them in the proper order. Here we go. I'm going to title those. It's lesson one. Save that. Lesson two. And lesson three. And then finally, I'm going to add the last quiz. Module three quiz. And the question is, which instrument can Ben play most proficiently? So your choices are guitar, piano, tambourine, and theremin. Tambourine is the correct answer. I'm going to click create question and done. All right, check those out. I can view this as a customer and you can see what everything looks like. go to the next lesson. So this is actually the view that your customer would have when they're actually taking the course. All right, and we'll take a look at it as a visitor too. So this is the view someone would have if they were looking at your course on your website. And this is already set up this way right out of the box. So pretty cool. Now you just click publish and it's all ready to go. All right, we got it done in less than 10 minutes. Obviously, if you have longer videos or if you have more modules and lessons, it might take a little bit longer, but for the most part, you can put your online course together pretty quickly if you have all of your materials ready to go. If you want to try this out for yourself, you can go to podia.com slash sign up and get our free plan. On the free plan, you can build online course drafts and you can do everything that I just did, get a feel for how the online course builder works and see what your online course would look like once it's published. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.